This might look like the perfect FTV location. How about this? Which one feels more cinematic? Believe it or not, even a paradise can look, well, boring. Have you ever gotten a bad vacation photo from your grandma? Well, you can tell location isn't everything. Before you even think about locations, you need to think about your piloting skills. Are you truly mastering the art of flying? You see, it's not just the where, but it's the how. It's how you navigate, how you capture, and how the world around you is lit. Even if you have an amazing location, but you're not that good of a pilot, you can miss out and that whole shot could be ruined. That's why I want to help you grow as a pilot to improve your skills. But first, we need to learn a few things. Lighting can transform your scene, give depth, and even create moods. It can be the difference between an average shot and a cinematic masterpiece. And even a seemingly dull location can come to life with the right lighting. So as you can see right now, it's pretty good lighting. And how you can tell is one, the clouds are overcast. So that's good and bad. But for this, it's going to cast an even lighting across the scene. Second is at sunset. You really want either sunset or sunrise or golden hour because these are going to be the best for your footage. When you're just starting out, you might just think, oh, I can fly through that hole right over there. But a better way to look at it is to go through and fly in between rocks up here. You can't see it, but there's rocks over here to fly in between and then through the hole down there. That will give you a more dynamic shot and it'll just look better overall. And really, that's how you can improve your flight skills and just taking your skills to the next level. Now, you hear everywhere that gear does not matter. Well, it does. Investing in good equipment and actually understanding it and all of its features can make a difference between an average shot and a cinematic masterpiece. Think of it as baking. Even the best chef needs a decent oven. So you've honed in your skills, understood lighting, and now the right gear. Now let's bring that all together. The next time you're on a hunt for that perfect location, just remember, it's a symphony of factors, not just the location. Because the world of FPV is about capturing moments, not just places. Okay, I understand this now. It's more about skills and not the location. And you just have to master lighting, camera work, and you just have to have pretty good skills. You know, I wonder what would happen if you did this for 100 days. huh? It's a pretty good idea. Might have to try that out.